Hello and welcome to part 4 of uh, Sonic Adventure 2. I'm Jeff. I'm Tyler. I'm Josh. And uh, um, One thing I forgot, uh, we forgot to mention in part 1 is uh, Boblex is our new permanent me uh, member, actually. Yay! <laughs> I forgot to say that, and I, I kind of wanted so to say welcome. that at that point. <laughs> oh, well, p pardon me, I'll, I'll do the intros, and I must have just just thought about the game. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, it's Aquatic okay. Mine. Yeah, um, I think they got tired of Sonic levels, so they just decided to do more uh, Knuckles and Tails levels in a row. Yeah. Yeah. And then they just somehow adapted that into the plot, and then, yeah. Well, I'll, I'll complete this level in about two and a half minutes, so it actually isn't that too bad. No, not really. Uh, uh, one thing they could have done, though, is just have three treasure hunting missions in a row, and it wouldn't matter at all. Ooh. You mean three levels? Yeah, like three uh, Knuckles levels in a row, just to get them out of the way. Because, uh, if you think about it, Knuckles uh, missions don't really have anything to do with the plot until later in the game. Yeah, you're right. It's kind of like a subplot, which does come into play, but not till uh, later. Yeah. Uh, same with Rouge. No, I do. Well, actually, I was gonna say Rouge does interact more with the main plot in her story. Actually, yeah, she does. Never mind. Yeah, she actually gets Chaos Emeralds at one point. Mhm. Mm mm. Now this level, I know it's most hated, but uh, in terms of like learning the clues and the locations, it's actually one of the better ones to do it. Just I would have thought this level is more hated. I actually kind of like this level more than others. Uh, well, yeah, you know, I'll say something good about this level. At least it's compact. Mm -hmm. you, you know what I mean? Like it's not That's too. Like. Yeah, it's just one big tube. Now I do it. take a detour here to get a very important item. Is it that a uh, a breathalyzer thing? Yeah, the air <laughs> necklace. The, the breathalyzer. I think a breathalyzer is what uh, people uh, have to use to like uh, test out how much alcohol they have. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this Knuckles music. Knuckles getting drunk. Anyways, um, oh, I made it through this game without this. You can do it. You just gotta get lucky with the air bubbles. But uh, you don't really want to go through this game without this because it'll make your life a pain. Yeah. Yeah. It's a really helpful item, and I suggest getting it. Yeah, it's I kind of have it to do this to this day, actually. Uh, yeah, it's kind of annoying how it's out of the way in this random level because it's, pr oh, it's pretty much required. Like it, as Tyler said, it isn't. It is possible to do it with uh, without it, but it's really hard to do it without. It's more recommended to do it with this rather than without it. Yeah. Well, I'll grant it, if you miss getting it in the main story, if you, like, quit the game and uh, replay this level in stage select, you can still collect items that way. Yeah. yeah. I don't want to do it when I'm in the middle of the level, because Knuckles is near the end of the level. That level's a pain to play through. Uh, by the way, it's a level that uh, everyone's together in. That's not going to come into play until, like, way later near the end of the game. Yeah. Yeah, how are you getting so many A ranks though? It's the time. Yeah. Huh. Well, I've heard that using the clue monitors does lower your score somehow, but I think the time is essentially just give you an A rank. And that's something hmm. I wanted to point out. If you want to get all A ranks, if you're going for that, when it comes to the hunting levels, just use the clues. Mhm. Mm yeah. I still haven't gotten uh, A rank on every level to this day. I haven't either. Uh, me neither. And honestly, Although I do want to someday, it's just so I can play that uh, Green Hill Zone level. Yeah, I was going to say. But, uh, oh well. Mm -hmm. I c honestly, I, think, I, I, I don't think I could do it. And suddenly Knuckles. <laughs> oh, I ran into a plumber while I, w while I was in the sewers. <laughs> he says, give my, <laughs> give, give my regards to Sonic, I'll see him at the Olympic Games. <laughs> What? Uh, oh, why does you need him to move aside? It's not like they're going into the sewer. Well, Tails, Tails would have, like, uh, curb stomped him. <laughs> uh, Let's take the tornado into the sewers. 
That doesn't sound like one of the best ideas. Now, uh, suddenly the tornado turns into a car. I want okay. to make a, uh, a, 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 a Super Sega All Star transform joke, but uh, that would be too obvious. Uh, we need dubstep for that. <laughs> and Record Ralph. And Record Ralph, yes. And I don't think Record Ralph's anywhere near this game, unless someone mods it in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, now we have these levels here, which I guess is meant to be like the Twinkle Circuit from Sonic Adventure 1. Mm hmm. It's. Except more plain and boring. Yeah, that, that's my only problem with it. I don't, I don't mind like this little mini game for its gameplay thing, but uh, the level's just a bit bleak and bland. Mm -hmm. I think it'd be yeah. cool. If, I think it'd be cool if you drive through the if you drive through the streets of the city. Yeah, with much more buildings other than some highway way up in the sky. Yeah. This sounds like something that should belong into a Mario Kart game. I don't know why. No. Uh, <laughs> I think Mario Kart does have at least interesting levels, so oh, I'll, yeah. I'll give it that much. It wouldn't just have a blank. Well, actually, maybe if it, maybe if it was on the SNES, the original yeah, the, Mario Kart, the, the Super Mario Kart would probably have something like this. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But even more simplified. Now there are optional missions you can get for this level where you complete the uh, this stage w without t hitting the cars. Or even without or touching the walls. The the... Yeah. Oh, that one's deadly. Especially if you don't know how to drift, because drifting is really weird in this. Is it, uh... uh, uh, uh never mind. I was trying to think of a game that has wonky drifting. Oh, Sonic Unleashed. How about that? <laughs> uh, well, I was about to say, does this level even have proper drifting? Because I just take my finger off the accelerator. Uh, that's what I normally do. And sometimes uh. I even still hit the wall. No, you have to double tap A, and then it goes into drift mode, and then you just have to uh, uh, con uh, control tails into a straight line again to get out of the mode. Yeah, and the it's thing, really awkward. And the thing is, this is a mi mini game you can play through the stage select, and you get like optional tracks. Mm -hmm. And you also get optional characters uh, if you A rank all uh, the missions and levels of a certain character. You get uh, an optional character. Yeah. Um. Did that car just go flying? Uh. Yes. Okay. Um. Oh, if you have the uh, battle version, or if you bought the battle DLC on the PSN and Xbox Live Market, uh, all the characters and stages you can unlock are all unlocked at that point, anyways. Really? So there's no need to really A rank them for the uh, the extra stuff, anyways. Oh, I just unlocked them in the GameCube version, so... Mm -hmm. Well, even in the GameCube version, that's where uh, they're all unlocked from the beginning. They are? Wait. Yeah. Well, no, I'm not talking about, like, Shadow and Eggman and stuff. I'm talking about their extra characters, like their alternate uh, uh, cars. Oh, alternate cars. Okay, I was, th I, think, I was thinking you were talking about, like, uh, 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 Chaos Zero and uh, Tikal. Oh no, that's not racing at all. Uh, I thought you talking. I thought you were talking yeah. about multiplayer. Okay. Oh uh, yeah, I was talking about kart racing multiplayer, but this gameplay is bland. Hold down A to win. It's the beta of Sonic Unleashed. This is stage. more like Sonic Rush. Uh oh. Uh, actually, Sonic it. Unleashed too. <laughs> well, I've only played Rush Adventure, but that's like the pinnacle of holding. Uh, uh, the boost button to win. Yeah, I haven't played those games yet, so... I've only played Rush Adventure. It's not the best game, but... Yeah. Uh, Minigun Kart Racing with three courses is now available. I never got that message, I don't think. Really? I don't remember doing. I was going to say, it is mandatory. It is mandatory? Oh, okay, then I probably did, and I just didn't care. <laughs> no, um, yeah. I just wanted to point out that the President's Secretary kind of looks like Maria. Yeah, in a way. Uh, Spoilers. <laughs> Maria's one of the main characters of the other stories. It's not spoilers. Well, no, it, isn't it only, like, in the dark story? Yeah. Because it's mostly just, like, Shadow talking about her. Yeah, it's all in the dark story, but uh, you can do the dark story first if you wanted to. 
Yeah. So it's not necessarily spoilers. I guess. Whatever. Uh, the president here, who actually returns in Shadow the Hedgehog. With the same model. <laughs> <laughs> the model's pretty bad in uh, Sonic the Hedgehog, uh, Shadow the Hedgehog. At least it's not a six. Uh, some of the shadows weren't loading quite correctly there. Did you notice that? <laughs> yeah, these are cutscenes. You can, well, you can tell they're, they're, they were originally on the Dreamcast. Mm -hmm. Look, I don't want to say they've aged badly, because I actually I don't think they have. No, they haven't really. <laughs> but uh, I was gonna say you can still tell they're over ten years old. Yeah, how do you jump out of a ve uh, vehicle like that? Actually, <laughs> <laughs> platformer logic. I guess. Why is Knuckles with them now? That's not part of his mission. He, his mission is to find the uh, the, the thingies, the uh, chaos, the master emerald charts. Well, he needs to follow that bat girl also. <laughs> <laughs> um, I was trying to think of a joke about her tits, but I couldn't think of one. Um, <laughs> the only thing that popped up in my mind was Naked Gun, but I couldn't piece that together with it. Chow? No. Uh, wait. No. No. Uh, another Tails thing. When are we going back to Sonic levels? Never. I, I want to say after this. Yeah, after this one, actually. Yeah, after this, actually. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Tails is outside and Sonic's inside. Uh, now, if you fall in the sand, you just sink and die instantly. Oh. Well, if you're the mech character. I think if Sonic lands in sand, he can still jump out. Really? What? Yeah. I think Eggman can jump out of sound in uh, the boss fight for Egg Golem. Why does he fight Egg Golem, by the way? Uh, cause Sonic, uh, destroys him, kind of, and wrecks his brain, and then he thinks Eggman's bad for some reason. Yeah, it defies its master, stupid beast. So well, Like, that hasn't <laughs> happened to him before. <laughs> he He's really unlucky with, uh, uh, called beasts and all that. Now, I think compared to the other levels, like from Sonic Adventure 1, uh, the levels in Sonic Adventure 2 don't have that much variety in terms of, of uh, style. Like, no. what I mean is there, there, are, there are city levels, there are Egyptian levels, and there are space levels. With so the basically odd... the, the basic motif. Yeah. yeah. Now, now, granted, yeah. There, there are, we, do have, we do, for example, have a forest level. Which is probably why I like Green Forest so much, because it's nice to see a green level in this game. It isn't bland colours. Mm. And also, and there's also lots of industrial base levels, like the gun base, of course. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah. Um, one thing I've noticed about uh, a lot of the mech missions, uh, there's not, like, too many, uh, specific things you have to do with the guns. All you gotta really do is shoot some things so that you can advance through. Which doesn't really sound like it should be in a Sonic game. Although well, it... Well, with Sonic Adventure. <laughs> it kinda worked in Sonic Adventure, to me, in a way. I don't know why. It's my... probably because I like Gamma, in yeah. a way. Or maybe it, it was because you just have five short levels in that game. Yeah, probably. Yeah. And in this game, we have ten mech levels that well, are really long. I was going to say, we have nine mech levels. Nine? Yeah. Um, because Tails, uh... Tails has a racing level instead of a mech level. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yes. Okay. Oh, what's the spring doing? That's weird. It was launching, it was launching you sideways. 3D Sonic games. <laughs> That sounds like something that uh, would happen in, um, I'm thinking, uh, maybe Sonic Heroes, and especially 06 and all that. Uh, I don't think Shadow of the Hedgehog was especially glitchy, though. It was just horrible It was just bad. Design. Yeah. Bad design choices. Mm -hmm. Guns in a Sonic game. That's Call not what I really Hedgehog. hated about Shadow of the Hedgehog. The gunplay was actually good. Well, also, classic badness from the uh, Adventure 1. 
Yeah, that's nice to see. Yay! And mm. speaking of which, uh, you don't. This is the only time you see the the old badniks in this game, because mainly it's gun robots. Yeah, because basically who these are. Yeah, which does make uh, sense because if you were playing as the dark character, it would be pretty silly to have them destroy badniks. Mhm. Mm uh, in the dark uh, version, I don't think you fight any of them. No. Um, you do fight them in Sonic and Tails for a bit, but uh. Not for anything otherwise. They're not really in the game too much. You, you can see this level is sort of getting a bit repetitive with its design. Like you go up a tower, then down a tower. Yeah, that's why I don't really like the mech levels too much. But at least it's over. Yay! Oh, and by the way, the point of this level was to find the entrance. Which... There's a helicopter pad right there. And Tails has a, Tails has a plane. They could have just went above and landed here because as we can see tails can pretty much just land that thing instantly at least you like... get an A rank hooray hurrah yeah you done good <laughs>